Welcome back to Electro Study. In this session, I am going to discuss important questions from the topic two part network. Before beginning the session, I request everyone to go through my previous session on two part network. I have briefly explained the concept of two part network in my previous video. It's available in the i button. Also, I have put in the description box. Kindly watch first. Later, you can come back to this video. So, what I covered is number one. What is a two-port network? What is Z parameter, Y parameter, S parameter, and ABCD parameter? And the condition of symmetry and reciprocity. These are the things I covered in the last session, less than ten minutes. Within ten minutes, I have covered. Let's show. Uh, let me show you the important questions from the two-port network. Have a look on this. Try to solve. Find out your convenient answer. find out the best answer and note now note down in a separate paper later you can verify those answer which i am going to discuss so that you will be getting a self evaluation chance for a self evaluation so only five questions i have included remaining i am going to put up in the forthcoming session so let us try to solve these questions first later you can come back for the detailed discussion all right i think these are the five questions and moving on to the discussion so please read the first question thoroughly so what's the first question yeah for a two port network to be reciprocal i have explained what is the condition of reciprocal already explained here uh, identify ad minus b is equal to 1 z11 is equal to z22 this is not the one this is also not the one now these are the confusion But h parameter we cannot apply directly. So moving on to the right answer, I am going to select y two one that is equal to y one two. So please select option A. Option A is the right answer for this question. Let's get started. The second question. Answer for the second question. The short circuit admittance matrix of a two port network is given. So identify which is the right answer. So this is actually a matrix, no? Okay, we call it as a Y parameter or Y matrix. Okay, this is a Y matrix. Correct. This is Y one one, Y one two, Y two one, Y two two. Here we can say that Y one one is equal to Y two two. Also, Y two one is equal to minus of Y one two. So, let us consider. The second condition, y two one is equal to negative of y one two. Okay, now what could be the right answer? So we can, of course, we can say it's a reciprocal condition, right? So which would be the uh, right answer? Is it a reciprocal or non-reciprocal? That you have to identify. So bit confusing. Have a look on this. Yes, the right answer is we can go ahead with this. option b it's a non reciprocal and active so please select option b any confusions you can put up in the comment box i'm happy to reply okay now let us discuss another question the network is having no source of emf is called which one passive network active network electric network and of the above so you know active network does not require any voltage source any uh, source is required for operating the active network so the right answer for this question i can go for option d active network so network is having no source of emf is called active network you must have studied about uh, passive and active component like that you can proceed with the question question number 4 a condition that a two port network is reciprocal can be expressed in terms of abcd parameter you must have uh, recalled what is abcd parameter the right condition for the reciprocal okay like we can call option d ad minus bc that is equal to 1 so please select option d i think it's a, a right choice uh, among four now i would like to discuss last question of this session two two port network are connected in cascade or series the combination is to represent as a single two port network the parameter of the network are obtained by 
multiplying the individual, which is the right matrix. Either Z parameter matrix or Y parameter matrix or ABCD parameter matrix or H parameter matrix. Actually, the right choice is ABCD parameter matrix. So these are the five important questions which I could select for you people. So kindly go through those questions. In case any clarification is required, I'm going to answer at the comment box. Kindly give your valuable suggestions and feedback for the improvement. Uh, wish you a happy learning. If you are watching this first channel, if you are watching this channel first time, so please do subscribe. If it is really useful, kindly share with your friends and don't forget to give your valuable comment. So thank you for watching this video. Happy learning.